Room Raiders California with special guest star Summerland Zac Efron. On this episode, watch three hopeful singles get the surprise of their lives. Oh my god! When they find out they're going to be picked for a date with Zac. Hooray! The catch is they can't use their looks or charm to win them over. They will be judged by what he finds in their rooms. You need to clean your brush. Yeah. Maybe I should try these on. No! Don't try to run out! You've got a pretty decent body. Of course. I'm going in. Hey, what's up? My name's Zach Efron, I'm 17, and I'm an actor. For the past two seasons, I've been working on a show called Summerland. My character's Cameron. Cameron's actually a girl-crazy kid next door. He goes through the ladies pretty fast. I like to pick one and stick with her. In my spare time, I love to hang out at the beach, love to travel. My dream girl would look just like a younger Catherine Zeta-Jones. So that pretty much makes me a younger Michael Douglas. My best physical characteristic is probably a very pronounced gap in between my teeth. Zach is going to choose one of these lucky girls. Hey, my name is Karen. I'm 19 years old and I work at a bank. My ultimate goal is to be a counselor and help watch people. In my spare time, I like to dance and I like to sing and I write poetry. There's true love. True happiness is chosen through the spirit friend. Hip-hop dancing is fun because I'm really good at shaking my ass. Guys find it pretty intimidating to dance with me or any of my friends because... We're too good. <laughs> Hi, my name's Katie. I'm 19 and I'm a beach bum. I love everything about the beach. I like to surf and bodyboard and just hang out. Professionally, I have no idea what I want to do with my life, but as for right now, I'm just doing what I want. I don't really know what I like to do on dates because I haven't really had a good one yet. I think I have troubles with dating because I just don't put out, so guys are kind of frustrated with that and I'm just a virgin. Hi, my name is Sarah. I'm 18 and I am a senior in high school. In my spare time, I like to cheerlead because it keeps me active and there's always a goal that I can set. My ultimate goal would be to graduate from college and become a teacher. My best quality is that I'm an outgoing, bubbly person and people say it's contagious. What turns me on is a guy who can make me laugh. <laughs> I always laugh. <laughs> the girls don't have a clue they're about to be abducted. Gun room raiders, come on. By surprising them, they will have no time to clean up anything. Oh my god. No, no going back. Come on. Get in the van. Let's go. To hide their identity, all photos of them will be removed. Come on, let's go. Come on. Uh, no time for shoes. The girls don't know that Zach is about to rifle through their bedrooms. Drum room raiders. Come on. Come on. Come on, the show starts now. Get in there. You're on Room Raiders. My name's Zach Efron from the TV show Summerland. It's so I know. It's a good show. Oh, yeah. By the end of the day, I have to choose one of you to accompany me on a date. Okay. The catch is, I don't get to see or speak to you before I make my decision. However, I do get to raid your room and see what you're all about. Oh, no. But enough with the chit chat. I've got my spy kit. Let's get started. Oh, oh no. I don't raise the I'm going to go to my room. number one. Yeah, this is my house. Uh, <laughs> looks pretty cool. It's got the whole apartment thing going on. Maybe you're going to college. I am in college. Let's check this out. Don't, don't dare so. <laughs> what lies beyond this door is a mystery. Let's reveal it. Nice uh, line. <laughs> yeah, you're in college. You should get this furniture from your grandma. <laughs> Help me! More like thrift stores. Anyway, a house can only say so much. Let's see what you're really about. The room looks nice. It's a little plain. It's not plain. It's definitely a girl's room. I'm a girl and it's pretty. <laughs> Let's check out the bedside table. Oh my gosh. A mosquito net. Do you have a bug problem? No. <laughs> California, no bugs here. So is this to keep people in or out? No. 
Anyway, let's check out the drawer. All right, a junk drawer. Yes. What do we got here? Oh my god! Oh no! I did it. Oh no! <gasps> But you have condoms right next to your bed. Easy access. It's just a joke. That's what they all say, darling. Mm. And look at that, handcuffs. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I like the way they're next to your bed, too. I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, yeah. Maybe you're pretty wild. I'm not a freak, I promise. <laughs> That's cool. I can work with that. You are a freak. Moving on. What have we here? Oh, that's my poetry. Writing. Randomly expressing thought until a sudden answer is exposed from an accidental organization of your own jumbled mind. Does that make sense? Mm -hmm. That's awesome. What? <laughs> that's deep. That's cool. Oh. I hope you wrote that. That's creative. I like creative people. Cute. See, I'm not that much of a freak. Well, these definitely aren't your grandma's panties. <laughs> you got animal print. Actually, animal print. There's a uh, there's a conflict. See, my mom loves animal print. What? what? It's just sort of a weird connection. Why would you make a connection with your mom? I wouldn't like to see these on my mom. <laughs> anyway, enough with underwear. Put those away. Put those away. What have we here? A hairbrush. Oh, shit. <laughs> well, this looks pretty gnarly. I'm gonna use the spy kit. Taking up the spy kit. Ah, uh, here we go. <laughs> oh my gosh. You need to clean your brush. Ew! I'm sorry. <laughs> There's some white stuff in the hair. I don't know what that is. What? I don't have damage, I don't think. She's got a little bit right there. It's okay. <laughs> Overall, the hair is kind of gross. I'm gonna use that. <gasps> oh! You could at least throw it in the trash can. That would be the nice thing to do. I'm moving on to the closet. Don't go in there. Right off the bat, I can tell you have a good sense of stock. I like clothes. Hey, you know what? I think this might look good together with something I saw a little bit earlier. <gasps> oh! oh my god! Yes. <laughs> I'm sure both of these look awesome on you together. Yeah, I wear that outfit every day. <laughs> Just that. That's all. I think I've seen. Everything I need to see in this room. Thank God, let's get out of there. It's so embarrassing. Let's head out. <laughs> oh, no, he did it in my underwear. Oh, what are we going to do with that tonight? He's going to give it to his mom. <laughs> so I just finished searching room number one. I found a shirt that matched some underwear. I love a girl that takes pride in her appearance, so that's a plus. I found some poetry next to her bed. She expresses her creativity through writing, fine through acting. So we're sort of on the same wavelength there. There were some things I didn't like. I found a hairbrush full of mats of hair and dandruff. Hopefully she takes a little bit of care of her own hair than what I found in the brush. Well, I'm done with house number one. I obviously can't make my decision yet. So on to house number two. Coming up, Zach cools down to Katie's <laughs> and tries out for the team at Sarah's. Great! Later, Zach meets the girls for a dramatic showdown.